ever come to the table as, your, as yourself. Mm. To hear, I know you're being quiet, you got sunglasses on, you got a nose ring, your belly button's showing on camera. I didn't even, that, that's his belly button. Like, yeah, I didn't know that wasn't oh, that shit. belly button. <laughs> he has twins. <laughs> if we can just actually cut, and actually I can just talk to Kevin on stage and whoever the creator of the app is, when you hired me for this, you never said there would be an extra belly button on one person. I don't want to hear from you right now, I just want to hear from your belly button. <laughs> when you're at the poker table, I need you <laughs> to have your own persona. You're not just to hear his belly button. Your name's Hector. You're in the Haitian War. You're mad at France. You want reparations. You're a belly button. You're fighting for independence, and you're fighting a little bit of liberty. Okay, mm -hmm. that's your story at the poker table. You stick to it mm -hmm. because when people are playing you, they're like, "The belly button man. What does he have? He's from Haiti. Why does he have two belly buttons? His tattoos from a pencil drawing. Mm -hmm. These are important things at a poker table. You know why? Because it's, they're focused on your backstory, not the cards in front of them. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? This is good. This is good. Let me tell you something about. Sydney, that was hilarious. That was, I mean, I tried to stay a character, but that was hilarious. I need you to trust your instincts. Mm -hmm. I need you to look at the person across from you and say, you're handsome. Exactly, thin. Was that the lie? 